Sam McEwen reporting. The Mix 99.3. Friends, family, and as many listeners continue to mourn the death of Cool Hits 105.7 radio personality Mark Justice, who passed away early Wednesday morning at King's Daughters Medical Center after suffering a heart attack. He was 56. Justice brought smiles to the faces of thousands of Tri-State radio listeners with his Breakfast Club morning show, a program he'd hosted since 1985. Justice started at WLGC as an announcer in 1984, taking over the morning show a year later. Before that, radio listeners knew him as Mark Damon on 94 WAMX in Ashland. He also worked at WCAK in Catlinsburg during his career. As program director, Justice was a mainstay at WLGC, seeing the station through various formats, a little bit country, a little bit rock, totally country music, and then the Cool Hits 105.7 format, playing the hits of the 60s, 70s, and 80s. And Mark gave me, as a 16-year-old high school kid, my first break in radio after I'd hung out the station, had to have driven them nuts when it was in downtown Greenup. He and Rob Shibley and Bill Geyer, all of whom have oh, yeah. passed on. Uh, 28 years later, my work in radio continues, and there will be a celebration of Mark's life. That will be tomorrow, 2 p.m. at the Advents Memorial Methodist Church in Flatwoods. There is a memorial fund set up at Kentucky Farmers Bank. They're taking donations there as well as the Cool Hits 105.7 studios at 1524 Winchester Avenue in Ashland. My heart's very heavy. Well, we lose a uh, radio ally and a good friend. And, of course, uh, it's so funny because when radio, radio has changed throughout the course of the years. Of course, we've been there during a lot of those changes. And, uh, you know, some of the fun factor of the business has been kind of suited out, if you know what I'm talking right. about. Yeah. But our company has been very much um, dedicated to allowing radio to be radio and people that uh, are in charge of the creative element to do what they do and that's very rare in this business it's extremely you know. rare and uh, mark uh, took that to the baton and uh, uh, he um, led the parade and then is so you know one of the kind of kind of guys that uh, could inspire and uh, and did as you know like that. mentioned hired you and others and uh, he and did what we missed uh, we talked quite a bit about him yesterday yeah. and his uh, his contributions to the radio business, but as I said yesterday, and I'll say it again, Mark could have worked in any uh, radio market that he wanted to, but chose to stay here because he loved Flatwoods, he loved his friends, he loved the family and uh, community. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, so I again that uh, celebration life just in case yeah. somebody missed two, it. 2 p.m. tomorrow, Advance Memorial Methodist Church in Flatwoods. Okay. Well, you know, Valentine's Day uh, coming up.